Hi, it's Christina. I hope you're doing well. I just wanted to make an extension of the video I did last week and it's about how to make money selling your clothes in the closet or any clothes and buying and selling online on eBay and different sites. So I just am on a couple sites. I'm on eBay. I'm on Vinted, Poshmark, Macari, and I was on Let Go and I used Debop. I haven't used that as frequently as the ones Poshmark, Macari, and Vinted. So basically what you do is you buy clothes or you get the clothes in your closet, you list it on these apps, and then you could put a price and then if people are interested, they'll buy it. And then they'll pretty much mail you, uh, email you, a stamp so that you could just put it on a package and then you could just mail it out so you don't have to pay for shipping so that's really nice except for eBay you do pay for shipping but the other sites like Vinted, Poshmark and Macari prints out the shipping for you and then you just ship it out and um, in order to make good money on this or just a little bit more than what you normally make what I do is for clothes that are used that me and my husband have that I know is not very fashionable or something from a long time ago I'll just sell it for like I don't know eight to ten dollars but what I do for other things to sell a lot which I've been doing is like for instance um, I bought this dress at Forever 21 it's embroidered it's black it's lace it's really pretty and it was on sale originally $29.90 to $13.99 and then they had a half off sale this weekend so the $13.99 was actually instead of $14 it was $7 so I bought like all the dresses that they had they had like eight dresses and then I just sold it for $15 and so I made like $8 and I sold like almost the whole bunch of them. Like I sold like I think 8 dresses. So that's like 8 times 5, that's like 40 bucks right there. And um, easy money and it's fun and I love to go out there shop and things like that. And another thing I did was like for instance these embroidered tunics. You go online and you see what all the bloggers are blogging about. You see all these embroidered tunics, embroidered leather jackets, um, stripes, is really in style, pink color blush. And then you sell it so that you know what's popular and what's trending. So these were originally like $70 and then they were on sale for $30 and then I got it for $19.99. And then I just bought the whole thing at the store. There was like, I bought like eight of these. I already sold like seven of them. And I sold them really inexpensive. I only sold them like $25, $30. Um, other people on eBay and the other sites sold them for $80. But they probably hold on to them for a month or two where I might just hold on to them for like a week. So I already sold like six of these and bought them at 20 and I sold them at like 30 on those apps and then it's just really fun to do that and then um, I went to Topshop and this Topshop dresses retail for $90 it's the wrap dresses they're really gorgeous and I got them when they were on sale at the store for $45 and then Topshop had this really big sale buy one get one free so this $50 dress I bought for $25 and then I sold them for $40. So I don't try to make like this huge profit. I'm not like some big corporate America big wig or something. I'm just trying to help people get some good discounts and sales and um, get something that's fashionable. So some mistakes that you could think about that you can learn from me is I was saw this Prada bag and it was like $420. And I was like, that's such a good deal. I have to get it. And I didn't read the details and look what I got. It's like super small, it's like the size of my hand. So I thought it was a regular Prada size bag, but I got this really cute small bag. So make sure you um, check out the measurements and the size of everything that you do purchase um, ahead of time. 
And then another thing that I wanted to recommend for you when you do do this is you want to record everything. So I have an Excel spreadsheet and I did this a little too late, so now I'm all confused. So I have five different pages. One says Poshmark, one says eBay, one says Vinted, and one says Macari. And then I write down the date, who purchased it, the description, how much I purchased it for, how much I sold it for, and then I have this record of things. And you want to make sure that things are recorded properly and carefully as you sell them. So today, I sold three things. And so I'm going to ship this out today, but I also put in my Excel spreadsheet that day too, so that I won't get too overwhelmed with too much at all. And I also wanted to give you a little secret because I'm Christian and I love God, but um, I really believe in tithing. So, you know, I believe that if you give 10% of your offerings to the church and to the, your place of worship or whatever, that God will bless you and that he will give you more than what you've ever given to him. And that's one of my sh really big secrets. I've sold like at least over $2,000 worth of stuff. And so I give to God what's deserving of his and he gives to me. And that's the only Bible verse that says that you could test him and see that it comes true. So that's a little sh spiritual secret on my end. So I'm just selling um, a lot of cute things and you could find me on Chanel Coco Lee 2012 on eBay or you could find me on a bunch of styles on Vinted and then on Macari you could just I believe it's also a bunch of styles and also on uh, Depop I'm a bunch of style and on all the other styles apps i bunch of styles or christina cha <laughs> but i'll leave the description and um have all these really cute bags and i sell less than everybody else pretty much and i only make like five bucks each on each item because i'm not trying to make this huge profit i just love helping people to look good be fashionable um, I grew up not having a lot and I always wanted nice things and I couldn't afford it so I don't want to like rip people off and I just wanted to um, show you these cute things that I sell like so like this shoes right here at Zara it's 119 and I picked them up for 70 I, I picked them up for 19.99 and then I only sold it for like 25 bucks or 15 bucks. These are really cute. So I just want to encourage you guys. Um, it's really easy. If you have any questions, just email me or let me know. I'm on Instagram, Facebook, as well as YouTube. And my whole goal is to encourage people to be confident in who they are and who they are and just to be um, happy and whole in the way God made you and thank you so much for watching please like and subscribe or just tell your friends about this channel and I hope to help you with something in the future soon okay bye